Hi, I'm Quinn from Oz Lifting Products. Today I'd like to go over some things to consider while operating and maintaining your Oz Builders hoist. One thing you want to consider with all electric hoist is there is a duty cycle which is printed on the ID tag. Something very important with this wire rope hoist is that you have them hung properly. As you can see it has a pipe style mount with a safety hook and latch. This hook is not to hang from. We have it stated on the hoist. The Oz Builders hoist feature a brush style motor, which it is very important to periodically check your brushes, which are on both sides of the hoist. One of the main components is the wire rope itself. Before every use, it is very important to check your cable. Check it for cuts, frays, kinks, anywhere that might be on the cable. It is also very important not to bird nest your cable. And what I mean by that is if you bring your load all the way down while the hoist is still running, the cable will loosen up on the drum. When you try to wind the hoist back up, the cable will get damaged. You could break the hoist. There's a lot of issues that you can have with bird nesting. While using, it is very important that you keep tension on the cable at all times. If you ever feel that your cable is not wound correctly, the best thing to do is unwind the rope all the way out and carefully wind back in. I just went over a few things about the Oz Builders hoist. If you need more maintenance or periodic inspection information, please reference your owner's manual or visit us at ozliftingproducts.com.